The Federal Reserve, they're not going to do a darn thing about uh, food inflation. Uh, to what's important to Americans, it's kitchen table items. And it's not just food. You mentioned food as being a major part of this. It's everything. It's from your kids' sports. It's coffee. It's tolls. It's the everyday items that are really hitting Americans in the pocketbook. And again, th that has to be engineered via supply chains, increasing supply, reducing government regulations. Uh, raising interest rates is not going to do a darn thing about that other stuff. It's that uh, line from the Vietnam War where they say you got to you know, destroy the village in order to save it. Uh, we're being told by the powers that be, these wizards are smart, that we need to put millions of people out of work in order to bring inflation down because they keep talking about uh, the labor costs and wage inflation that's out there. Th that's nonsensical. There's two sides to every single equation. Uh, you want to uh, increase supply out there. I think that's going to be great. Putting people out of work is not great for the economy. Again, what's going to happen? The government's going to have to print more money uh, in order to pay for all the unemployment benefits, SNAP benefits, and everything that goes along with that. So there's a cost there as well.